least it's a nice day. When you come back in, it'll be all nice and fresh. something that 4-H does for all yeah. the members. Okay, everybody else left me, but the goal is to have all this cleaned off so we can get out all the junk from under there. Yay! Okay, so most of the stuff I was, well, a lot of the stuff I was able to move by myself, but this bag here is ripped open. Oh, nice. That's lovely. Um, and this pallet is heavier than it looks, so I'm going to need some help. better with the scoop I guess. Alright there's the line. That's a disinfect that you put down underneath the bedding. You're with the bale straw already.
for another 4-H roundup. We had a busy morning, but we're here now and we're all set. Why don't you just walk them, walk, we'll rock them right up to the scale. Yeah. they gain from now at this roundup show to the fair so <laughs> he wanted him to get weighed Yeah. I'll put. Yeah, 
I'm gonna put that between okay. these two, right. and then maybe move that one over to these two. But if you time, just move them to the kitchen. Yeah, Kaylin, you can bring it. We didn't bring any Pre-show wash. Yeah, when they're white, <laughs> they get dirty. <laughs> she just had some spots that she couldn't get. Looking paint, so she thought we were washing. Looking good. Yeah. Uh, okay, lunch before the show. What's on the menu? Uh, peppered ham sandwich. Oh, nice. With cheese. With cheese. Carrots <laughs> and mayo for us to find out for dad. He has mustard. That's why yours was a blue one marked. Your bag. All right, showtime. Here we go. Kaylin's first. She is in the second, no, third uh, lightweight class, and she's the first to show with kids.
very soft through his center body and deep down into his flank. And yet he still does it with a lot of shape right behind his shoulder, transitions that to his loin edge and down into the lower portion of his quarter. He's maybe not just the most attractive about his head and neck, but I'm going to call him good enough balance to go ahead and start this class today. He can go off of, off of either end as he travels the ring. He's one that still does have some productivity through his center body, but compared to the steer that stands in front of him, Yep. Yeah. Can you get a towel, please? Can you get something? Are you getting it? No, we get it. All right, that's another first place for Tegan. <laughs> On deck. Parker, right here. Our next class is the heavyweight class. So when I call your name that you are on deck, make sure you are on deck. They're picking the grand champion right now. So they're out there. Muscle and power. And there's two out here that I think are very similar in terms of their type and kind, in terms of how they balance up. <laughs> there. There she is. Grand, grand champion. champion.
kids, they need to go out and work with their steers. Right? That's true. Even though you think That's I'm naggy. If we would do it anyway. Uh. <laughs> hey, I think I deserve some credit. Probably maybe in the like 90% of the time the walking chaos was initiated by mom. It's okay. There's probably every mom has to say that. It's not anything against you guys. You guys do an awesome job. Takes a family. Yes. Family. That's true. Yep. Alright, so we're headed home. See you guys next time.